What's up guys, how's it going? Today's video, I'm going to show you how you can install Postgres on any Arch-based Linux distribution. If you're not using Arch-based distribution, that's fine. You can follow along, just the package manager that I'm going to use will be different. If you're using Mac, you can also follow along. So I'm using Arco Linux, which is also based on Arch Linux. So the package manager that I'm going to use is going to be Pacman. If you're using Mac, you're going to use something like Homebrew. So first we do install the Postgres package. So sudo pacman dash capital S, then Postgres SQL. All right, so Postgres is now installed. Now when you install Postgres, it will also create another user called Postgres. So let's log into that user. So sudo dash iu then Postgres. And now we have logged in as Postgres. We also have PSQL installed, so we can just type PSQL. And we have an error because we haven't initialized our cluster. We can do that by any db dash t, then the path var slash lib slash postgres slash data. And it has created the cluster. Now we need to start the service, the postgres service. So I will exit. So to do that, we need to type systemctl start postgresql and then give you our password. And now we need to enable it. So enable postgresql. And we can see the status using the status command. Postgres is enabled and it is also running. So let's log in again and we should be able to start psql so psql and we have entered in the psql we can see all the users so we only have now one user postgres we can also see all the databases so let's create a small table so create table users name for char 200 and we have the table now let's insert a user so insert into users table we can pass the name the column name and then values and the value will be on john and that's it we have inserted one row so we can see everything select star from users and we only have one row. So you can see Postgres is working totally fine. So that's how you actually install Postgres on your system. If the video has been helpful for you, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.